Okay, so it is not very often that we talk about models that are not anthropic, not deep seek, and not open AI. However, although I'm not a big fan of Google's models personally, I do still test every model with prompts to see how they perform. And I must say, I am I am very impa- impressed by the content writing ability of Gemini 2.0 Pro Experimental 0205. This was a model that was released five days ago. Um, it's got a 2 million token count, which is amazing. It's currently completely free. It won't be free for long. I'll tell you that for free because it's a good model. But I wanted to show you how it performs with this writing prompt. Now this writing prompt, the idea behind it is to write a full length article that is human readable, has, you know, it's not obviously AI, okay, and that it has your context in the article. Now the way that the context works is that you have to add this context yourselves, okay, and I'm just going to quickly show you how to do that just because I think it's important to show this every video. So basically, within this prompt, the prompt itself is only a page, right? But everything else that you add to it adds to the prompt. So there's two things you need. Well, there's a few things you need to add. You need to add a keyword. If you want to add more technical information because the topic is technical, that's where you add it here. And then internal links, literally all you do is just go to the sitemap of the, you know, whoever you're writing for. Find a sitemap index page that has a lot of the a lot of the uh, internal links that you might want to use on it. So, for example, I'm going to use the collection uh, sitemap. What this does is it gives us all of the collections, and collections on Shopify are always a good thing to internally link to. So, I'm going to click in internal links. I'm going to do Control Shift V and paste my internal links. If you want to use this prompt, by the way file, make a copy. Do not ask for editor um, access. Also at the very top here, work with us. If you're interested in having SEO done for you, there is a link to work with us at the very top here. And then the other thing we need to do is image embeds. The way this works is because the keyword, as I'll show you here, is uh, best sneakers for men in 2025. So we just use a little bit of logic and we say, okay, so we need a load of sneaker images. How do we get those sneaker images? So we just go to two men dot it slash collection slash sneakers, right? We highlight the first sneaker. We scroll down, we scroll down, control shift click to highlight everything. Control C to copy, paste to markdown on Google, click the first one, control V to paste, control A, control C to copy. And then we put this, um, inside the image embed. So control shift V again, and there we go. Okay. Now let's try this prompt out. When I just tried this prompt before, this is probably the best, uh, article that I've seen so far of any of the models, right? So better than open AI, better than anthropic, better than anything else, to be honest with you. So maybe in terms of writing, this is the path that Google is going down. Um, I don't know, although I don't know why, because the only Thing that's going to happen there is they're going to have more problems weeding out their own AI content, which doesn't really make sense to me, but there you go. So, um, the actual writing style is what I want you to focus on here, right? So I really like the way that this is actually written. Okay. So instead of the classic, like step into and blah, 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 it's more conversational. It's more like it was actually written by a human. So for example, hey there, are you on the hunt? Like it's still a bit cringe, I understand that, but it's just, it's it's better written, I would say. Maybe your old ones are worn out or maybe you just want something new and cool for 2025 where you've come to the right place. I've been a huge fan of sneakers my whole life. I even remember getting my first pair of really cool high tops when I was about your age, if you're seven, right? They were bright red and I thought I could run faster and jump higher in them. This article is about helping you find your perfect pair the ones that make you feel awesome, right? So I'm just going to quickly copy a piece of this, right? And we're going to go to GPT-0. And we'll just scan for AI here. Now, the last one I did came out as not AI generated, but we'll see how this does. So this is actually also human. So this is very, very interesting to me. So it seems like the prompting is actually being followed better because 
like I've been saying in the last few videos, this prompt should technically pass AI detection, okay? Just because of the way it's written. It's this part here, by the way, if you're curious. This is how you pass AI detection normally with an intelligent model. However, DeepSeek did not do it. ChatGPT03 kind of did it. But, you know, this model here, Gemini 2.0 Pro Experimental, is actually managing to follow the prompt so well that it does actually pass AI detection, which is absolutely massive, right? So yeah, overall, I really, really am impressed with this model, at least compared to other Google models, which I've been, you know, I've had huge problems with Google models in the past. Let's just check a few things here. It looks like they're not actually using H2 tags, which is a bit annoying. Oh no, they are, they are. Uh, are they using image embeds? Yes, they are. Uh, overall, like I'm very, very happy with the article here. This seems to actually potentially be the best one that I've seen. It has good internal linking. Um, it, it does use the same internal link a couple of times. I don't really see that as a huge problem, to be honest with you. A lot of people see that as a problem, but you know, I don't really mind it. I, I don't really care about that, to be honest with you. I think you know, the more internal links, the better, generally speaking. So further down, it is 100% AI generated. You can kind of see that just by the way it's written. It seems to have just lost its uh, panaz or je ne sais pas, or whatever the word is. But yeah, overall, you know, I mean, it's getting to the point where it's passing AI detection. It has internal links. It has images. It's done a better job than DeepSeek. It's done a better job than OpenAI 03. The only one that it hasn't necessarily done a better job than because I haven't tested it yet is Anthropic. Now, I haven't tested Anthropic yet because I do think Anthropic will win. But this is a very, very good result for a completely currently free API, right? Now, I'm sure the rest of these will do an absolutely terrible job. I will just very quickly, while we're here, test it out on something like Flash, just, just to kind of see how bad it is. Um, but yeah, we'll see. So we'll try this one more time. The prompt will be in the description of the video as usual, guys, by the way. Uh, there's no like, you don't have to sign up to anything or you know anything like that. It's literally just free. Okay, this is actually not too bad so far. Uh, I don't like that it's done this weird like image embeds thing, but that's okay. That could be prompted out. A lot of internal links, too many internal links. I mean, it's not terrible, okay? It's not, it's not good, but it's also not terrible. Like, it's done just as good a job as DeepSea, to be honest with you. Um, I'm not used to Google being anywhere near this level of competitive with... Uh, with any other AI, so this will 100% be AI generated. You can just see it, just read it. Are you ready to step up your sneaker game in 2025? That is the most AI generated sentence you will ever see. Finding the perfect pair can feel like searching for a needle in a haystack, but don't worry, I'm here to help. Yeah, I don't know. I think the other one was much better. GPT-2, uh, Gemini 2.0 Flash doesn't seem as good. Thanks for watching, guys. If you are watching all the way to the end of this video, you're an absolute legend, and I'll see you very, very soon with some more content. Peace out.